the question was whether the MyStand, which is, I think, a unique device with special features, is uh, able to uh, perform similar to design stents in, in an all-comer real-world patient population for the treatment of coronary artery disease. Well, the MyStent is a stent that has a specific uh, feature where the bioabsorbable coating is uh, dissolved within three months, whereas the drug, which is a microcrystalline serolimus drug, is present in the vessel wall up to nine months. So uniquely and in contrast to, to all the other devices that are available at the moment, this particular stent has the possibility to have drug effects at the time that the coating has already been dissolved. It was a non-inferiority design and we randomized 1400 patients in 20 centers in four European countries uh, and we looked at the 12-month clinical outcome. This basically was an all-comer population, there were very few exclusion criteria. We had patients with acute coronary syndromes um, for about 60% of the population and we also treated patients with left main disease, with restenosis, bifurcation lesions, vein grafts, uh, etc. So this is a real-world population in contrast to some of the other studies where there is a selected population of patients or a selection of lesions treated. One year outcome was basically that the hypothesis of non-inferiority was confirmed uh, with a p-value of uh, less than 0.001. The target lesion failure rate in the MyStem population was 5.8% and in the Zion's patient population was 6.5%. Uh, well, one of the interesting features, of course, is that if you think about drug effect at the time that the uh, coating already has disappeared, is less new intimal uh, proliferation. This was uh, suggested from the uh, first uh, in man study and uh, dissolved two study, where late lumen loss was one of the endpoints. And also the uh, sub-study with uh, OCT points into that direction, that new intimal proliferation with the my stent is less or maybe less than with the Zion stent ultimately resulting in lower target lesion uh, failure rate or target lesion revascularization rate at 12 months and maybe later on as well. And well, at the present uh, time, I think, for the, uh, the science stands and some of the stands that are evaluated, they are, they are hard to beat. Uh, I think that my stand is a serious competitor for science at the moment.